I started playing field hockey, I was about nine years old, um, so quite late. Growing up, I always did hockey and cricket, um, cricket through the summer and hockey in the winter, and, it, and, and at that age through school, it was a pretty good split. It wasn't until 2007 was the Junior World Cup, and that was in the summer, and then that, then that was basically the first summer that I missed playing cricket and played hockey all the way through. People always said that I would need to choose uh, one or the other, and, and basically I just fell into the hockey first. That was probably the uh, defining moment which sent me on one path as opposed to choosing or, or doing as much as I did. I think um, the disappointment of Rio and then stepping away from, from hockey after that um, gave me a pretty good perspective on life. I took myself away from hockey a little bit, um, but it wasn't until I stopped completely where I, um, yeah, then started to miss it, which was the which was the hope. Um, if I didn't, you know, then I didn't lose anything. I could move on with the next stage of, of my life. But um, yeah, I hoped that I would miss it and, and get that hunger back uh, to start playing again. And that's pretty much how it unfolded, which has led us to where we are now. I'm full time, so yeah, we'll be uh, in the gym most days, and then we'll be on the pitch with the team uh, three days a week, and then games at the at the weekend. So that's the other thing is then finding that balance of uh, training and training and training, and then being fresh and uh, and mentally fresh, being a, a really major component of that as well. Um, to then yeah want to keep going and have that hunger and desire to, to win and be great as well as here I feel they, it's, a, it's a nice balance. The most rewarding part is for me two things, one winning. I won a lot of games but didn't win uh, a lot of tournaments so the, the tournament, the main tournament that we won and the other medals that we won are, are, are very rewarding um, but equally as important are the people that you do it with um, and those experiences that you, you share with them.